We had a hard practice before um, at 3.30 yesterday and talked after and you know we'll, we'll come together today and I think, um, I think they're resilient, they want to respond, I think they're looking forward to playing uh, and as I said once you got over the disappointment we knew we were probably on that bubble obviously and it was maybe a little bit of a long shot and uh, once that happened we said okay now it's time to move forward and what an opportunity to play in a very prestigious tournament. In our meeting I just said we wanted a chance to be in the NCA. We didn't make that chance. Now let's be the best NIT team we can be. And here I said before, if we can get to the NCA, we'll be the best NCA team. Well, we can't get that. Let's be the best NIT team and um, the ability to try to finish the season strong. Uh, we acknowledge we didn't play our best basketball against NC State uh, in a couple of those games. So let's really try to, to finish this thing strong. Obviously, you want to send, you know, John Tell and Doug our two lone seniors out uh, to the best of their abilities, but this is a good tournament and I think our guys are excited to play and know that we'll have to play well and it's another good situation, good experience for our younger players to be in and, and certainly a, a good reward and opportunity for our two seniors. And when we were in the preseason NIT, um, we really wanted a chance to do that and now to have this opportunity, I don't think there's a team that is in the NIT field that doesn't hope to have that chance to you know, to win three games and then play in, play in the garden, that'd be a big thing for sure. But, you know, that's obviously a goal, but we know what's in front of us and um, the ability to play well against a, a veteran team, as I said, and, you know, uh, respect what Coach Evans has done. I said that last night, too. He uh, went undefeated in his league and had a heartbreaking loss. But um, they're no stranger to good basketball, and we've seen them two years ago here watched him in the Paradise Jam the year before, play Marquette, beat Ole Miss, and then um, what they did in the NCAA tournament last year, a, lot, a number of those players returning uh, gives them some valuable experience. Veteran players, good guards, good inside guys, I think they're, they're talented. Again, I think as you saw in the NCAA selection show in the NIT, um, parity is, has arrived in a major way in college basketball, and, and you um, probably have one of the best fields in the NIT in recent years, so um, you respect everybody you play, and we have uh, nothing but respect for them and know that we have to play to beat whoever it is we line up against.